Hello friends, welcome back to SQL with Manoj. In my previous video, we saw how to install SQL Server Analysis Services that is SSAS in multidimensional model. And in this video, we'll see how to install SQL Server Analysis Services in tabular model. So in SQL Server 2012, a new type of queue functionality was added that was in memory. And uh, that was a bit different from the traditional multidimensional model or, or the MOLAB model. So this new functionality is based upon the ROLAB that is row OLAP technology and the name is tabular model and this tabular model is basically memory optimized because the whole uh, tabular model data sits in memory compared to the traditional MOLAP technology okay so today in this video we'll see how to install SQL server analysis services in tabular model uh, you have to notice that you know if you have already installed SQL server analysis services in multi-dimensional mode you cannot change it to a tabular and similarly if you have installed analysis services as tabular model you cannot change it to multi-dimensional model so if you want both of the models then you have to do two installations or you have to create two instances of uh, analysis services okay so uh, we have already installed MOLAP that is the multi-dimensional model of analysis services today we'll see how to install the tabular model so I'm going to the SQL Server bits so here this is the SQL Server 2014 folder and I'll just click on the setup.exe just click on installation and click on new server standalone installation or add features to an existing installation so this new window will pop up I'll close the previous window because this is not required anymore okay so I'll deselect it and click next so you can just click next uh, we will be performing a new installation of SQL Server 2014 okay then click next I'll just uh, go with a free edition of evaluation accept the license agreements click next new SQL Server feature installation the next okay so here we already have you know the database installed we already have a database engine services installed and we already have reporting services and analysis services but to have analysis services as a tabular model I just click again here analysis services and then click next so you don't have to check anything else you just have to click on analysis services to have a new instance of tabular model okay so here we have to give a name to the tabular model okay so here if you see we have already a separate instance of SQL Server 2014 which are running these instances one is the SQL Server 2014 that is MS SQL Server that is database engine this is MSAS means analysis services and MSRS this is the reporting services okay and uh, the abbreviated features are here SQL engine ASRS then SSMS and IS that is integration services okay so here I'll uh, I'll probably give a new name to our um, analysis services SSAS TM that is SQL Server Analysis Services Tabular Model 2014 okay and I'll copy it here okay and then click next Okay. so if you want uh, so in my machine I've just you know I'm just installing it for test purpose and learning purpose if you are installing it in your dev machine or test machine so you have to give probably your account name and the passwords so right now I'm leaving these as it is click next so this is the analysis services configuration window okay while installing where you have to select that your analysis services will be a multi-dimensional model or a tabular model so multi-dimensional is by default and we have already installed it so we'll click on tabular model and I will add the current user here okay so this will add the windows NT login right as the current user 
okay so the end user has been added now I click next and just click on install so it will install all the required files and just wait for its completion So we can see analysis services has succeeded and we can close this box okay and now let's go to SQL Server Management Studio so I'll just click on SQL Server 2014 Management Studio and to see the installation of analysis services tabular model we'll just select the server type from this drop down that is analysis services and we will type the instance name that we gave that was SQL Server Analysis Services Tabular Model 2014 SSASTM 2014 and I'll click just connect on this and you can see here the tabular model the and you can even see the icon right it is a bit different from the multi-dimensional cube icon it shows you the computer name Manoj Pandey hyphen LAP slash the instance name of our SQL Server and Analysis Services tabular model and you can even see the version number here analyst services 12.0.2 xyz and and expanding the databases you can see the databases here you can restore uh, the databases the tabular model databases here but to create the tabular model databases you'll have to use ssdt that is sql Server data tools so you cannot create uh, tabular model databases from here okay and in our next video i'll try to show you how to create tabular model databases from scratch okay till then stay tuned and please like the video if you really like it and please let me know your suggestions and let me know if you want me to cover anything else okay thanks a lot